What's up everyone? Earlier today I released a video showing how to jailbreak with a Mac. Now I'm going to use a Windows laptop here. First I'm going to show you that I am running 5.1.1 on my new iPad. There it is right there, 5.1.1. Now I am going to go ahead and I've already downloaded Absinthe. I'll have the link to that in the description below. Now you'll have to extract the file. Once extracted, you will right click on Absinthe and run as an administrator. And this will extract the jailbreak app. Let it run through this process. This won't take very long. Once this process is done, you will get an Absinthe application or an executable file on the desktop here in a folder. Open the folder up, and then you will locate the Absinthe app, and then right click and then run as an administrator as well. This will bring up the, the jailbreak tool. Make sure your device is plugged in. It will locate your device, make sure your device is located, and then select jailbreak, and that is it. Now it is beginning the jailbreak, and as it says, it may take a little while. But in all actuality, this does go pretty quick. So now it's sending the initial jailbreak data to the iPad. Let this run through its process. Now it's sending the final jailbreak. The device will look like it's restoring right here. It looks like it's restoring and then it will restore complete. Now it will respring. Now all of this is hands off. So just let it do its thing. Don't touch anything. Here's the little respring type logo. Let it do its thing as well. Now you'll see an Apple logo come up. This is probably the longest process, is just waiting for your device to reboot. And it'll go back to the little spinner. Then after this, you will see an Apple logo with a progress bar. This will go pretty quick as well. And now your device will probably show up with the lock screen. Don't touch anything. Don't unlock your device. And let's head back to the computer. And it's waiting for the progress to complete. And then now it's done. Once you see the done, you can go ahead and head back to your device and unlock your device. Slide to unlock. Once you've done that, you head to Cydia. You'll see a Cydia icon here. Open that up. And then it will prepare the file system. Again, don't touch anything. Cydia will exit when this is complete. It will respring your device. This could take a little while as well, but the whole jailbreak process with the laptop or your computer is complete. So you can close out of that, uh, that system. Now if you are experiencing any issues, it's most likely because CD is being hammered quite a bit with this jailbreak. Now once that is done it will go back to the lock screen. Slide to unlock here and then head back to Cydia and then select user, hacker, or developer. I usually select developer and there you go.
Now your device is up and running, jailbroken on iOS 5.1.1. If you have any questions, leave some comments down below. And also, I appreciate it if you would hit the subscribe button above and hit the like button down below. That really helps out. If you want to see more videos like this, don't forget to, to hit the subscribe button above. So, I appreciate you watching. This is Paul. God bless.